The mindset, you know, I know this. I don't care what side that anybody on. You should love one another. I've been saying this. It's because you're supposed to love God with all your heart, mind, body, and soul, and love thy neighbor as yourself. And it will bring this. Um, people can't tell me what I didn't do because I didn't say it. How did someone tell me what I voted for? It's crazy. So, I think people need to shut the lips. Whatever happened, Yeah, you know what? I didn't do it. And last time I checked, I don't... If I told you all... Let me just say this. If I told you all, don't commit suicide because I'm overcoming the depression. What makes you think I'm saying, oh, it's okay to shoot someone when I told you to drop the guns and, you know, and but tell you about... You live by the sword, you die by the sword. You live by the gun, you die by the gun. First of all, and I heard that that person that shot Donald Trump was a Republican. That's what nuts to me. That's crazy. You shoot your own people. Like I said. So while you say, oh, you don't like or disagree with it, but you, you're a Republican. You shot your own people. That's what we, that's why I don't get involved in politics. And, and that's why I say, how can you be we the people? I've been saying this. How can you be we, we the people if you're doing friendly fires, if you're doing anything like that? You know, regardless, you're America. You're supposed to be what? Well, but that's why it's divided. That's why it's being, you know what I'm saying? Biblical God see Babylon will fall. And this is all biblical prophecies, right through your very eyes. Now, like I said, I'm not the one that said Donald Trump's dead. Mm -mm, I'm trying to see some. That's the citizens that did that. The prediction and stuff like that. And they did some other people too. And you say, oh, the predictions is what you've been doing that for many years on social media. That's why I said. You know, now I hear, keep on hearing about Donald Trump, and they, they, people jump on the bandwagon late. But you see, do you see me jumping with balloons and jumping like that and say, oh, he didn't know I did not do that. I did not do that. All right, but first of all, as I said, is boring to me. Like, it's not boring, but it's like, it's just like, okay, we talked about it. Now let's move on. You have to have a move on. You have to have a better day. People, it happens to people all the time. Before you end up idolizing somebody that you shouldn't be idolizing. If you were really, you know, hey, he and be honest, I'm not being mean, but he was a, he was a celebrity before president. You all were complaining about, oh, how he just came in. He was racist. Some of y'all hypocrites and apologized to Donald Trump and saying, oh, you know, I'm sorry for this and this and that. I want you as president. So, I mean, come on now. No, 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 no. You know, that's also another thing I got to say. Now you're worried about he shot. I mean, you know, I know what shot, but I'm just saying, you become hypocritical. You apologize to the man about, oh, I'm so sorry. Oh, there's all about this and this and that. You jumped the van wagon. But before all this, before he was a president, even trying to run for it, what was he then? You guys weren't saying his name like this?
So I'm not, I'm not here beating you up, but dang, man. Don't be idolizing somebody because guess what? You got to put God first. And I'm not saying that I want this to happen to me, but look, he even told you, love Jesus. Like, you know, we all need Jesus, right? I've been saying that. So that's something to think about. So put God first and move, you know, hey, he's okay. You saw after you got whatever anyways, you know, like this. So, okay, then, you know, stop talking about it. Move on. Just saying.